Hi, K4 friends. I have a silly story for you tonight. This one has a veterinarian in it, and if you know a veterinarian, then you know that is a doctor who takes care of animals. Well, in our story, there is one animal who's really sick. His name is George, and he is a dog. Now, do you know what sound dogs make? Can you make that sound for me? I think I can hear you barking. You're right, dogs are supposed to bark. That's the name of the story, Bark George. But friends, there's a problem. When George barks, it doesn't sound like woof woof or arf arf, not at all. Oh my goodness, wait until you hear what his bark sounds like. Bark Jules is, Bark George is written and illustrated by Jules Pfeiffer. You can see here is George, and this is his mother. She wants him to bark, but something else comes out. Listen to the sounds. You ready? George's mother said, bark, George. But George went, meow. <gasps> what was that? Did that sound like a dog? What animal says, meow? You're right, a cat. No, George, said George's mother. Cats go meow. Dogs go arf. Now bark, George. George went quack, quack. What? What animal says quack, quack? No, George, said George's mother. Ducks go quack, quack. Dogs go arf. Now bark, George. This time, George went oink. What animal says oink? No, George, said George's mother. Pigs go oink. Dogs go arf. Now bark, George. George went moo. Do you know what animal says moo? George's mother took George to the vet. I'll soon get to the bottom of this, said the vet. Please bark, George. George went, meow. Wow, the vet knew that wasn't the sound. So he reached deep down inside of George and pulled out a cat. You're right, cats do say meow. Bark again, George. George went, quack, quack. The vet reached deep, deep down inside of George and pulled out a Duck. Bark again, George, said the vet. George went oink. You know what he's going to pull out, right? The vet reached deep, deep, deep down inside of George and pulled out a pig. Bark again, George. George went moo. Mm, what animals do you think he's going to find? The vet put on his longest latex glove. Then he reached deep, 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 deep down inside of George and pulled out a cow. Whoa. Bark again, George. And this time, George said, Arf! Hey, that sounds like the right sound. George's mother was so thrilled she kissed the vet and the cat and the duck and the pig and the cow. She kissed them all. She was so happy her puppy finally was barking like a dog. On the way home she wanted to show George off to everyone on the street so she said bark George and George went hello Oh no, who says hello? Mm. Do people say hello? George was just with people. Do you think there's going to be someone inside of his stomach now? A person that says hello? Uh oh, his mom better get him back to the vet to find out. Friends, this is a silly story. I hope you enjoyed it. Have a good night and I'll see you again tomorrow. Night, sweet dreams.